Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and hello again, Cancer. Alrighty guys, so this is our first career and money reading for October 2021. Hopefully you guys are doing great. Um, if you guys are new, I usually have a description about the spread we're doing in the description box. But basically, 10 cards I'm going to pull, um, trying to break down a question, looking for the what, why, how, and when those elements of a question and obviously we're doing a career and money reading so we're looking for career advancement uh, financial growth those kinds of good things alrighty cancer so um, hopefully I'll also be doing a few of those for this month so let's see what we can practically come up with using those cards we're beginning with a six and a five so a six of wands the element of or the idea of setting priorities and overcoming obstacles okay there could be something going on there and right after that is a five too so we're looking at change we're looking at also wanting to overcome that change we're looking at <coughs> excuse me um, a few ideas that we need to kind of organize we are inspired though we have the element of fire though so Let's not say that the change part that we are going through is a bad thing. Why should change be bad? Usually a status quo that is boring, that doesn't serve, is usually not the fun thing. But if you are considering setting priorities because you have a goal and you are, in a way, taking some time to get creative with that process, that's, that's a great thing. Okay, so immediately, that's kind of what you are looking at. Um, a three of coins, which is understanding you know what one of the ideas that you may have so i'm saying here we did not get an ace we did not get a page but what kind of priorities are you setting well you're setting priorities about day-to-day -day work you're setting priorities about your approach to growth if you're watching this reading so now you're going to take that idea and try to create something what's new here for cancer what do can i do in order to make those three coins a nine and a ten okay it's gonna take some work but you're gonna get there and I know that and I know that of course I'm glancing but we're gonna have some interesting cards towards the end so stick around cancer okay three of coins what does that require three of coins is also about collaboration developing the idea relying on friendly folks friendly energies friendly mentors such as the king of coins so I like that we have some inspiring ideas to a point where we are dr definitely driven to cause a change. And now we are seeking the priorities. And now we are getting, you know what, others to rally around one idea to help you, to support you, to develop it to the fullest. Because guess what you have going for you? I told you this gets better. You have the world as an asset that works well for you. So what can Marwan say when cancer gets the world? In an asset let's talk about cancer the human let's talk about people skills let's talk about compassion let's talk about consideration of others in what you do in the way that you do things in what you dream in how you consider your um, goals for years and years ahead so I love the fact when there is that kind of wholesomeness to skill sets that we have it speaks of a mature energy regardless of age hey one of my children okay is probably way more mature than me uh, most of the time and and they know themselves okay so <laughs> so it's not about age but what a beautiful asset you have going for you ability to attract others to be around you okay to support you being connected to other modes of how people think how people communicate and all those ideas that we can draw out of that card a wholesome a wholesome goal that puts you on a path because right after that you have an opportunity it is not clear but that king of coins is going to clear your path as you walk by the moon okay so here it is cancer here's your moon all right and here's the moon too with the new setup but we have a path here that is going to be so cleared as soon as you get into that mode of collaborative you know what creation and also relying perhaps on a mentor now if it is not a mentor then you know something needs to be added to your knowledge there has to be some additional 
understanding or knowledge gained. But boy, with those prospects, I see you doing that because as a skill set for the world card, that means you're also in tune. You're intuitive. You're in tune with what needs to happen. You appear to be just like that crab in your element, okay? You're fine to dig deeper to find this opportunity, and I love that. The sense of um, faith as we go on an adventure. Not just the chest beating and I know I can do it, but the sense of I know God's with me. I know the universe supports me. I know karma plays for me. Because what a big heart we have here. And what a big wholesome goal. Outlook on the situation. Obviously the five again. Changes for money. Okay. That's what you're looking to do. Initially we began with a six and a five. Trying to select an approach. Build on it. Now we're talking seriously. I need to get to that six materially. Okay. The mind has been working, uh, the advice is coming, the program is at play. Now I would love to be in the settled situation, six and advancing forward. And you do and you will. And your timing is there, right? But you want to feel good about your plan. So here comes a queen of wands saying to you, feel good and not just that. Take some risk, Cancer, if you need to. Now, take some risk underscore here don't let that tarot guy you know what lead you down that path underscore what i also said check in with a mentor and this is not a plug for you to order a reading with me although i would love it but really check in with a mentor i'm talking about expertise of your uh, professional field cancer to be very very honest and serious okay yet you can take a bit of a risk what that queen says to me is you can get out of your comfort zone and you will so deliver so good okay and the purpose is really the better life so here's a five and a six and there is your seven you know what enjoying it probably maybe even related to a better work environment because again the the element of fire the spirit part the i'm enjoying things is with you there as a purpose so there could be that there could be the want the need to move to a better location to a better area a better environment and what you do when you follow these processes, when, you know what, you are so meticulous on the details, it's always something like that. It's always something like a ten of coins. It's always in your hands, Cancer. That's what I say, guys. The magic is between us, but really, you know your key strengths. You know what you need to hone in on a little bit more. But really, checking in with a mentor in the area where you work, and with that wholesome goal, oh my God, karma alone is a great thing. Something I say about money, and I'm not preaching here at all, but really, anytime you're trying to manifest more money, the minute you set a goal for charity in that manifestation, the universe immediately plugs in their own percentage of help to. This is if you wanted to play that way with universe or with God, but generally, you know what, the blessings just flow. Typically, we just need to be willing to receive. Okay, 10 more cards, ultra fluent. Let's do it. Position one. Here's the fool, alrighty, the adventurous part, okay, in terms of goal and what we want to do. We're going to move on with this. And here's the ace, okay, one of those ideas to set you on the path. We're going to make more money. And here's the king of swords, okay, the plan, the creativity you're doing here, the checking in with a mentor in order to put a fourth leg forward. Immediate result, and here's the three of cups feeling good okay enjoying the process as well why are you checking in with a mentor well it's not to make you miserable it's to make you enjoy it it's to give you the validation that you need that you know now you are trusting your faith but you have also done your proper due diligence what do we got going for us after the world okay two golden opportunities two golden opportunities no it's really more also the ability to build something guys to create something develop something opportunity comes as the magician first you got the moon part here but now you're going to dig deep into that faith that you have and you're going to find with the help of that mentor with the help of that guide okay with the help of god obviously after all and before all the path i love it i love it the magician cancer like i love this guy okay he doesn't know obstacles they don't know obstacles outlook on the situation maybe you are at times you know what digging deeper into your thoughts and here's a hermit but here's a hermit who's also wanting to act okay 
uh, timing wise we have a four we have a four of wands as if to say once you have your process established this is kind of also if you are a business owner if you're trying to implement a new policy okay uh, manufacturing if there's a new production line that we're tweaking things of that nature uh, once the process has been established once you know a little bit about the more tactical parts of the um, execution plan you're applying for a new job okay I'm going to check in on that discipline that's going to be my presentation that will be my approach this is how I'm going to rely on past experiences this is how I am um, translating my experiences from that area of business to that blah blah blue okay now position nine and you have the wheel of fortune that's the purpose okay fortune i love it good fortune is on your side you are seeking good fortune and the world is with you as a asset as a possibility already and here comes judgment you work hard you put your effort you put your champagne work ethic you get your champagne results cancer and with that being said, I hope you guys like this reading. Would love it if you would comment and subscribe. You guys are so amazing. And I want you to know we do love you madly. And bye for now, guys.